Kayla, I want to talk to you. Are you ready? And then Lisa, I'm coming to you. So, so both of you, I want you all to get ready because I'm coming. Miss Kayla, got your hair looking all cool over there. Kayla, <laughs> talk to me. How you doing? Hey, Rodney, I've been meaning to follow up with you. So receiving your email today was right on time. I'm so glad to get a chance to see you, see you walking around and all that good stuff. Kayla, what, talk to me, Kayla. What are you hearing so far? What are you hearing yeah, right now? Yeah, yeah. And, 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 and does any of this connect? Does any of this resonate? Does any of this make sense? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So many things. Um, first, I just have to say that I just appreciate you so much. I miss talking to you. So I have to do a better job of staying in contact. But I was um, a part of Rodney's grant certification program last year. Um, it honestly just a really low point in my life. I had a lot of stuff going on. I was trying to relocate and move. And taking that certification single handedly changed my lifestyle. <laughs> it's it's incredible that this is now turned into a testimony for you and for me Rodney because I mean look 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 at where I am wow. uh, you'll see the my background where I'm living um so where, many where is this is this Austin where is this where is this I'm in Austin you did it give me fire girl up <laughs> booyah Wow. Awesome. Tell me more. Yeah. Tell me more. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, sorry to kind of hold you guys up, but um, it, go ahead, Tyre. Go ahead. Uh, in the moment, uh, I was taking Rodney's program. Like I said, I was just in a low point uh, career wise and I wanted to do something different. And, um, you know, the first thing Rodney really instilled in my mindset was that you have to make the decision on what it is that you're gonna to do to elevate and change your life. And that's exactly what I did. He was able to work with me. I got through the program. And as soon as I was able to update my resume and update my LinkedIn, I wanted to come to Austin. And if you guys know Rodney, he went to UT, went, uh, UTA. And so he was down here, I believe undergrad. And you did everything you could to help me, aligning me with the right people, and so because of my grant writing certification on my resume and on my LinkedIn, the company, the consultant company that I, hold on sire, uh, the consultant company that I currently work for, I, I write proposals. They're, they're, they're RFPs, they're requests for proposals, requests for qualifications, also known as RFQs. So my job literally all day is to find funding and write grants for construction companies, architectural companies, basically consulting firms all over the US, not just Texas. So I have to contribute all of my success <laughs> to Rodney because you were amazing in being a mentor for me. Um, not only wow. that, some other, yeah, some other things that I'm hearing, uh, the TV, cutting out TV, uh, you know, when, when I spoke to you, uh, you know, last year or the year before, um, I cut out TV when my son was born uh, because of the agenda and certain things that I don't agree with in my household. And I didn't want to expose my son to that. Not only are you taking away, you know, that extra time where you're just, you know, like, you know, uh, frivolously giving up your time, you know, like you mentioned, you, you know, you're watching a comedy special for two hours and all you're getting out of it is a laugh, which is needed. But in terms of wasting your time and not being focused on what your goals are, um, helped me quite a bit. So it's been going on six years now that I haven't had TV. You save about $3,000 a year, by the way, uh, by not having cable and just, you know, wasting time doing that. So I've been able to grow my business, Instant Beauty. Um, I've been able to spend so much time on that, um, you know, and just growing my clientele and focusing. Currently, I'm in a, a program where I'm doing an e-com certification program. Awesome. Um, so, so, I just wanted to comment and, and, and just acknowledge that what you do is changing people's lives. And I, I'd love to get with you and maybe, you know, do a testimony video because it single-handedly changed my life. So I just want to thank you. Wow. I had no clue that you were going to share what you shared today. And let me say this. I am so proud of you. I mean, like, listen, <laughs> I remember the conversations we were having. I remember, listen, I remember when you were back in Arkansas and then to show me what you just showed me and to see how you stepped out. And I know you want to go to Austin to do what you're doing. Amazing. And, and you are a, a, a perfect example of what can be 
once you simply make a decision, because I remember Caleb making a decision, hey, I'm leaving. This is not, this is unacceptable. And you wanted something more, more for yourself and more for your son. And you made a move. And I'm just, I'm excited to be have had a, a little part to play in it. The biggest part came with you because I, I never will forget, Caleb, you made a decision to make it, you made a decision. We had a telephone, telephone call and we were talking about it. And you were like, hey, I'm getting ready to do this. I'm getting ready to step out. And you stepped out and I remember you being in the class, diligently knocking out the lessons, going through everything, learning. And then I was like, Kayla, you got it, you have it. And then to see what you're doing right now, where you just made some moves. So listen, girl, give yeah. me a high, give me, give me high five. Yeah, oh, yeah, girl, yeah. Thank give you. a high Thank five you. and send some love to Kayla, huh? Yes, and I really quickly, I wanna add that uh, originally I was in your program so I could, create my own grant writing services. I initially wanted to be able to do this freelance and on my own, but having adaptability and being able to change with circumstances, I was still able to land a better situation than I was in, although I didn't wholeheartedly create my own grant writing service it's still something that led me to an, a fantastic opportunity working for a great company. And so I just wanted to share that and say, thank you so much. You are amazing and keep doing what you're doing. Anybody on this call, this guy is pure gold. And I, I appreciate you so much. Wow, thank you. I, this is a pleasant surprise. Thank you for those <laughs> wonderful words. And I, I really appreciate that. And yeah. I feel, listen, I feel like a, I feel like a, 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 a proud, Big brother or something around here. I feel proud because I'm like, man, she went and did it. And I love hearing that. And it, it just is a sign for others of what can happen. And it and I want you guys to hear me well on this one. Hear me well on what, what I'm about to say. I'm I'm really grateful that Kayla got a chance to come through our program. But for me today, what I'm sharing with you, this is not about me and my program. What I'm saying today is about you taking ownership of your life. And you can do that with or without my program. There are people that you align yourself up with that can help you to get to wherever you're trying to go to farther. And that's my goal is for you to look at, hey, who am I hanging around with right now? <laughs> and is this person helping to take me to where I'm trying to go? And if not, you've got to make decisions. I can't tell you what decisions to make. But you know what? They had this thing that's above your neck <laughs> and this thing above your neck will tell you what you need to do and share with you how to do what you need to do to get you to where you're going. I tell my friends all the time, I have some other friends, listen, you know, that thing, th this thing up here, it, it is more than just a hat rack, <laughs> okay? It's designed to take you where you need to go. It is the most powerful machine on the face of this earth, your mind. 